Hey everyone, Symbiote here, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 University Life Monte Vista style. Uh, this is going to be part 10. I'm pretty sure of that now because I had a chance to actually look at my footage. And I keep getting off on numbers because I shoot in advance. So, uh, sorry about that. So, okay, anyway, this morning, it's very early. It's 3.28 a.m. on uh, Tuesday for our Sims. And Evelina is currently sleeping. Hannah is currently sleeping. And I have um, Helia using her uh, text or her blog app. And what she's going to do is she's blogging. She blogged first to get some followers about this awesome Snuggle Bunny swing because I find that, um, especially in the review blogs, if you mention a specific product in game, you'll get more followers. Although we'll have to see because I think that the score she got will pop up in a second. And then I'm going to have her just blog about, um, just do a quick blog and take a picture of little Helix here. Yeah, this is him little Helix Spiegel, and unfortunately I wasn't able to get his birth on um, on camera because I had intended to um, I had intended to pick the seed excuse me and plant it again because the seed as you saw before was coming up as putrid quality and sometimes you just need to cycle that back through put it in and, and then give it really good fertilizer and I was going to do that at home but I clicked the wrong thing and she she uh, picked him the way you're supposed to with um, if you want to get a baby which is to actually select on the seed and click pick instead of just harvesting it with the rest of the garden um, so we got little helix and that's okay because he's a bundle of joy um, but because it was a putrid seed he is evil but that's like his mother and that's perfectly okay and he is grumpy but I've had grumpy sims before it's not that bad um, it says your sim will usually get sad before getting angry or uncomfortable and it's more difficult to get your sim into a good mood but really I've I've played with grumpy sims before it's not so bad so yeah there you go and my cat is being very loud once again so let's just dive right on in um, okay so she brought up her blog app and we're gonna take a picture Aww cute okay you captured my child that's th that's a, a new subject worth zero simoleons there are only eight subjects left to complete in uh, the family and friends collection um, her main squeeze yeah have you tried to capture my main squeeze yet she doesn't have a main squeeze um, so yeah we took a little bit of a picture and um, yeah, I think we'll leave it at that. The The blog she posted before was The Solace Snug Bunny Baby Swing is a lifesaver for maintaining the comfort of my plant sim baby. And, yeah, she gained 55 followers from that. So, yeah, all you gotta do is just remember the exact name of something and mention it in the review blog, and, and it's, it works really, really well. So, there we go. Um, now, one sec, let me just get my bearings. The kid is in the swing. He'll be fine for now. She has crap I've got to have her do. Um, she has class in five hours. And what's everybody else looking like today? Evelina has class in nine hours. And Hannah has class in 13 hours. Um, if worse comes to worse, if I can't hire a babysitter, because I don't know if I can, but if I can't, then Hannah has, um, has agreed to help out Helia, and she's going to stay and take care of the kid. Um, she's, she's fine with that. So, you know, uh, that's just how it's got to be. So she has yet to take care of her garden today. Sorry, I haven't played in days. <laughs> so now I'm kind of like a little, what? <laughs> okay, yeah, all these are outstanding quality and great quality. Perfect quality ginseng, nice. All right, I guess I'm just going to have her open the composter. Yeah, let's make this bigger. And we're going to put in some stuff to make it nice. And we still have our other plant seed. Um, so that's something to keep in mind. And what's the fertilizer strength on this? This is nice. Let's. We don't want just nice. We want great. <clears throat> Outstanding. Yes, that's a perfect quality cinnamon. Okay, so we're going to use composter, we're going to water plants, we're going to talk to plants, 
And then, um, yeah, geez, wow. It's been so long since I played. I just had, like, have completely lost my bearings. We're going to have her work on fishing and then maybe spend some time with her baby before she goes to school. Because I don't think she'll need to eat. And the other two are sleeping. Oh, what's this? You should pick that up. There's a nice seed spawner on this property in case anybody's curious and you're going to live here. It's very nice. Um, yeah, I hate when I, like, I haven't had to film because I recorded a huge backlog. And, um, okay, come play with your baby. It's, um, it's been a little, yeah, it's been a little weird. Because now I'm just kind of like, bleh. Alright. I think Helia can be a good mama. I think she can. Plus, she and her son can commiserate on how much they enjoy watching people suffer. Okay. No, see, she can steal candy from him. We're not going to do that. Now, it looks like she can't bio-boost him. Obviously, i never have her bio-drain him. Um, but, yeah. And give him a bottle. I don't think he's hungry, but give him a bottle just in case. And then put him back in here, and we'll set it to swing. And it'll be cool. Now, it's a Tuesday, so they don't have that much longer before school. Uh, or before school ends, which is nice. But I am... Um, I'm a little nervous. I don't know if, like, Child Protective Services might come. I I don't know really anything. It, it's, it's sort of new, and I haven't been able to find anything, like, anybody who's mentioned how this works, probably because nobody's been stupid enough to, um, to, like, make this mistake. So, it's, it's cool. It'll be fine. I'm sure that the game accounts for it. Hopefully nothing weird happens and he gets stuck here or something. That would really suck. Um, she's listening to... Where'd your tabcast go? Um, listen to tabcast? Where the hell did it go? Okay, so do that. And then I want you to... Actually, we're going to get her ready for school. Hang on a second. Yeah, okay. I need to get my bearings. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Alright, she's gonna go up. She's gonna take a shower. And soon... Yes, Evelina is up. She can... Make a bed. She can come down and give him a little bit of social by watching him. And then we'll have her eat. If we time this out correctly, there might just be someone here. Um, which would be really, really nice. Uh, she wants to watch Helix. Okay, well then, Evelina, you go eat. Three days until final exams. Okay, she's heading out. She should be fine. And she has... Is it Tuesday? So she's got one class today. Oh, perfect. Okay. That works out really, really well. So today we'll be fine. And we only have three days left, meaning that a couple of these ladies can skip a class. Um, so that also is excellent. So I think she's got lecture today. Let's go watch and see what she's up to. What's up with her hair? <laughs> That's really weird. My game's a little laggy. Not everything is loaded up yet. Come on, peoples. You can do it. I believe in you. I do. Hell yeah, get out of the way. Go to your freaking seat. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that leg. That's super awesome. Okay, hang on. Let's see what we can do. Wee. 
Come on. Yeah, still a little bit. <laughs> Invisible people. They're loading. Okay, now, Helia, I do not want you to fall asleep like you just did. Um, I would like you to... Actually, why don't you restore brain power? And then take notes. Stop being a jerk. Okay. That's just so rude to the professor. She goes, she sits right in the front row and she falls asleep. What are these two talking about? Okay. I guess they're having an awkward moment. Um, there is a crib here, just so you know. Uh, let's see. How's her school performance doing? She's got class in five hours. Her school performance is not as good as I would like. So I'm going to have her, um, she's going to listen to a guitar tab cast. And then she's going to practice sketching. And Hannah, I would like you to feed yourself. Actually, hang on, is she fed and all that? She'll be fine. Yes, okay. Come on down here. Like, clean up. I could have her clean the whole house. Eat leftovers. Yeah, this will teach me to, like, record so far in advance that I don't have to play for, like, five days. Because now, I am a bucket of fail. I am just sucking. Okay, she is restoring brain power. Is it working? Or is that not something she can do? <laughs> okay, it's just taking a long time. Okay, what did we just get? Um, Evelina has improved her guitar skill to six. Greetings, <laughs> greeting from the Lotso, yeah, Lotso family. We heard that you have a new addition to the family and would like to congratulate you. The Lotso family has sent Helix Spiegel a special toy. Gain relationship with it to reveal its special gifts as he ages. Retrieve this uh, the mail to place it in Helix's inventory. This is actually an instance where I may do the imaginary friend thing because I think it'd be cool to have a plant sim, a half plant, half alien sim, marry an imaginary friend. <laughs> I just think that might be interesting. So we'll have to see how that goes. And okay, so Callista Montgomery sent Talia another 33 simoleons for her, her blog. Those Montgomerys, they sure love her, uh, her stuff. Okay, so Evelina is sketching and having fun and her grades are going up. Yay, hurrah. She is eating while little Helix is sleeping. We're going to turn that back on after she finishes eating um, to slow. The worst part about that swing is that um, a lot of times you'll get teen or evil sims that turn it up to fast and then the babies start to feel sick. As long as you keep it on slow, it's fine. But for some reason they just have this inclination to turn it onto, um, hang on a second, there we go, yeah, to turn it to <laughs> fast, and it's kind of sadistic, and she's going to do that, and then we're going to have her take a shower, and then we're going to have her work on her own stuff, all right, so listen to Tabcast, and we're going to listen to Handiness, and then where's your brain thingy? Does she not have one anymore? Or is it out back? I bet you it's out back. Hang on a second. Did I leave it out? No. Oh crap. Do I need to buy her one? Because I feel like I'm, I'm just not seeing it. As you know, this is a, a running theme with me. No, I think it's gone. Okay. I guess, um, I can't remember who it was, but I, I appreciate it very much. Someone pointed out that when I did her personality thing, um, with her, 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 uh, cerebralizer, cerebralizer, blah, mouthful, um, it changed her, 
her like family relationships and things like that that's probably what did it which would make sense um but it may have also done something weird to her um yeah to her school stuff so I don't know okay you can buy the business planner um, I know these things aren't that expensive. There's the... Hang on. Hang on. I'm a genius. Okay. Alright. Computers. Tennis table. There's podium. Whiteboard. Uh, anatomy skeleton. Business planner. Um, okay. There we go. Cerebralizing Brain Enhancing Machine 1.0. We're just going to buy her a new one. Can I get her a different color than the original? Yeah, I can. Let's get her this sort of middle, darker one. Okay. So that's what she's got. Because she needs it for school. So now we have it. And we're going to have her... Actually, but... It... Yeah, now she has to upgrade it again. Damn it. Okay, so she's going to listen to... Let's get this going again. Oh, the trials and tribulations of a dummy like me. Okay, so she's going to listen to logic, which I may have already told her to do, but just to be sure. She's going to upgrade that to level 2. And we're actually going to bring um, a baby monitor outside. Evelina, I swear if you turn that up to fast, I will end you. Okay, so we're going to put a baby monitor helps if I do this. Thank you. We're going to put one right out here on this table on the porch. And we're going to put one right in here on the dining room table. Okay, come on. Work with me here. There we go. Sweet. Sweet. And we're going to go back and I'm going to see what Evelina is doing to this child. Watching Helix. Okay. I approve. Um, his social's going up. He's absolutely fine. She could use a shower. Um, when does she have class? Three hours. Yes, she could definitely use a shower, so we're going to have her do that. And, um, take a quick shower. Okay. And she's going to go out and work on her, her thing. Okay. Her brain power is not going up. Okay, so apparently you're allowed to do it, but it doesn't actually work. Um, however, just being in lecture, it hasn't changed. Um, it hasn't decreased her uh, school performance, which is good. The most important thing to Hannah, aside from deciding whether or not she's going to complete the, the job that she's been given here, which is to, um, which is to kill <laughs> Sid Cerberus, but aside from that, the most important thing is that her family is is well. So even though her relationship status has been changed in the game, that's that's not the case. She is most definitely still Evelina's sister-in-law and Helia's um yeah, and Helia's uh aunt. So that's their relationship and that's how it's going to stay. And they're close, they're fond of each other, they're having a good time here at university, and Hannah just really wants them both to do well. Evelina doesn't want to come, um... Evelina doesn't want to have to come back to school, because obviously she's older and may not have the chance. And Helia has offered, if Hannah wants to come back, to pay for it. So, you know, there you go. Okay, she wants to play chess. We'll see. Um, hey there. <laughs> hey, there's a letter for Helia from Ayana Yuki. It says, I know this is coming out of nowhere, but I think you should you should take a chance on me. I'm a lot of fun, and I think we'd be great together. Mm, pass. Okay. Well, you could play chess. You could. Um, let's get you going on another tabcast. Really quickly. Listen to tabcasts, and you're going to listen to fishing. And then I need you to check on your garden first before anything else. Okay. Tend garden, yeah. Go ahead. 
Now she's got a nice garden. It's a, it's too bad that the seed came out poorly the first time. I wonder if the seed quality on the other one is bad. It's around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, it's normal quality, so we must have done something wrong to it. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to water really quickly. Okay. Now, Evelina is in lecture, most probably sleeping. Oh, no, she hasn't sat down yet. Good. She's sitting next to Shay. Okay. Hopefully this isn't too loud. Um, take notes. <gasps> she decided to take notes on her own? Oh, man. Oh, girl, you know how to woo me. All these other youngins, they don't know how to do it. Okay. There we go. She's all set. She's fine. She's a little tired, but she's fine. Kiddo is fine, although his motives are going to start going down. Um, so we're going to turn that back on slow. I feel badly keeping him in this swing the entire time, but it really is the best option. <laughs> I don't really know what else to do. <clears throat> oh, somebody woke up. Okay, do not fall asleep. Good girl. Oh, yeah. I love you. Who's this? This is Connie Cronk. Connie Cronk. Eddie Mullis. Look at all these rebels paying attention, taking notes. Millie Grubb. She's a nerd. She's also taking notes. Good girl. Oh, Madeline Know-It-All. That's, that's the professor she's had. She's just frumping it a bit today. Apparently, it's wear your sweats to work day. Okay. There's the empty plant box where little Helix was born. And let's see if we can just bump this forward a little bit because everybody's doing their own thing. And I'm just going to watch his motives. Okay, good. She's going to... Did she turn that on? Okay. And she's watching him, so his social's going to go up. Excellent. Yay. She's doing great in school. It feels like her school performance should be going up. Because, I mean, as long as everything goes fine with Helia and Evelina, I don't mind as much. If we want to bring Hannah back here later, we can, because Helia will be coming back. Um, but really, that that's not that big of a deal, because that's not why Hannah's here. You know, I think she's pretty certain that she wants to do her job. Um, now that there's another family member, a young, vulnerable family member, I think she wants to take care of of everyone and make sure that they don't have any issues with the mob when they get back to Monta Vista. She needs to eat. Okay, Hannah has achieved the highest skill and handiness and will receive a hefty discount on all build items purchased in the future. Okay, she upgraded the machine. Yay. Yay for Hannah. Yeah, her academic performance hasn't gone up. So hopefully things are okay. Let's have her, actually, really quickly, let's just have her take out her phone. Wow. More study. Okay. Let's have her study hard really quickly, and we'll just see. She's giving that gnomon up the skirt shot. Okay, now, is it going up anything? Anything at all? Yes, it is. Okay, good. So it can still go up. I was a little worried. Um, she's going to have to change into her outerwear, I think. Um, change outfit. Pretty soon, yeah. She's going to have to start wearing her outerwear again. It is autumn. Let's have her put on her backpack. You're going to get soaking wet. Stop. <laughs> Stop. And she's headed home. Helia's cleaning up. And now we need to send out Helia <clears throat> to 
to do some of her social networking stuff. Maybe go see a movie and she can review it. Um, it seems like a good option. Evelina can... It sounds awful, but Evelina can stay here with Helix. And if you're going to play a computer game, I'd like it if you listened to a tabcast as well. So let's do that. And then play computer games. If you like. Um, let's have her play... Um, the sports one's not too loud, so I'm actually okay with that. Uh, okay, up to the map view. She has not gone to the bowling alley, so let's go to the bowling alley. We'll have her bowl a little bit. Maybe she can write a review of that. And then maybe we can have her write a review of, I don't know, a sports game or something. We'll figure it out. She wants to steal candy from Helix. We'll give it a shot. Okay, Hannah was just invited to a party. Um, I don't think we're going to do a party today. I'm I'm just uh, just now getting back into the swing of things. Okay, so why don't you go say hi to Chloe Mendenhall. Let's do a really loud introduction. <laughs> she thought it was funny. And every time we come here, I forget... Oh, someone likes her. I forget to go up here. I don't know if I did this last time, but I usually do. I forget to go up here and take a look. So up here you have grills and some tables, which is pretty cool. And you've got a nice TV. This is a nice hangout. Um, I feel like the Rebel one is actually kind of a dud. Um, yeah. Okay, I think we did come up here once. So yes, this is... This is that. You can see it again. I'll show you. It looks nice. Not got these cool neon signs. <clears throat> um, pool tables, football. Yeah, I like this place. I might actually put it down um, in one of my other towns. I don't know if it would fit in Monte Vista, but Monte Vista is becoming modernized. We know this. All right, why don't you bowl with her? Um, bowl with Chloe. Mm, my voice is very raspy. I apologize. <clears throat> Where are you going? Okay. Are they playing tag or something? Okay, we're we're having some weird stuff here. Come on, ladies. Oh, they are playing tag. Okay, no, don't play tag. Bowl. Bowl, bowl, bowl. Bowl with Chloe. I guess maybe somebody took the machine. Okay, we're going to let her do that make friends. She's not really friends with many jocks, so it'll be helpful. She's still got three hours on her tab casts. Let's check out where Miss Hannah is. Who's she talking to? Okay. Is that your machine? Oh, she left hers at home. Okay. Okay, so she's just standing here in class. Okay. Well, these people want to talk to her. Hang on. Let's... If she's going to do her lecture properly, let's put her... her, uh, cerebralizer into her inventory so she can use it for class and <clears throat> there you go you have it so go ahead use it join the school no study the brain study brain porn stash here wants to insult her okay 
And how did she get two of these sketchbooks? I think she picked up Evelina. She's a klepto. She's freaking stealing people's stuff. Okay. Is her jock influence going up? How's that baby doing? Okay. Evelina? She's still got time on her tab cast, and let's have her... What does he need? He needs food, he needs cuddles. So let's snuggle him. Let's give him a bottle. Let's change his diaper. Let's play with him. And then we'll put him back in. She's studying her brain. It's weird. They have class outside. They don't, you don't usually, like, it's great because in university life they, they seem to have toned down how often it rains. It really makes me crazy how often it rains in, um, in normal worlds. It's kind of, it, I don't know, it's annoying. But, um, Aww. hang on a second. So, all right. Helia started to build influence with the jocks. I'm going to turn this down a little bit, because for me, it's a tiny bit loud. Okay, hang on a second. With a powerful yet gentle psychic touch, Hannah Spiegel linked her mind to another sim, or with another sim. Um, okay, Hannah Spiegel is now a sci-fi fan with the nerd group. Congratulations, Hannah Spiegel has made an impression on the nerd group. She can chat telepathically with her kindred and share knowledge with another sim to increase learning. I didn't know that that's something that the average nerd was capable of. I would probably count myself among the nerds, and uh, that's not something I was aware that we could do, so bully for us. Alright. And then I want you to put him back, make him swing, and then she's got a lot of classes tomorrow. She's got two sketchbooks. Is there like a glitch where they multiply in your inventory or something? Listen to Tabcast. Guitar. Sketch. Okay, Hannah is home. Good, okay. Hannah's home. She can eat. And she can... I'm just gonna get her set up so we can go see what... Helia is up to. She can study logic. And if she really wants to sketch. Oh, can she sketch a still life? Hang on. Yes. Okay. So she can do that. He has his um his imaginary friend toy. And he's gonna pee soon. Um Oh crap. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Alright, turn that on. Then eat leftovers. Let's get her started. Um then listen to a logic tap cast. Then sketch a still life. And let's see what Hallie is up to. She's still bowling. Having fun. Wow, that was bad. This is a fun thing. I really missed it. Oh, she bowled a nine? Wow, that is atrociously bad. That is really, really bad. She wants to enthuse about comic books. Is there a bartender here? No, everybody just makes their own drinks. Lame. Okay. And you should... Social networking should do your blog. Who's she talking to? Oh, she's been invited to a party. She's not going to that damn party. Um, okay, so... It's bees bowling, right? Yes. Okay. Um, one sec while I think of a title. Okay, so... <laughs> I said, bees bowling gave me a bee in my bonnet. Those gutters block my shine. I gave it a B plus at best. So let's see. 
let's see what it says. Um, okay, it was, okay, it was good. She gained eight followers. So, you know, you gotta play around with it. Um, she's doing pretty well. Um, her school performance is impeccable. Uh huh. It's like seven something p.m. There's more I feel like we could explore. Uh, we could have her do a review of of something else. She's done Simburger. There's the bookstore, the university bookstore. And there's a party over at the sorority pass. Um, attend movie. Okay, so let's go see... I don't think she's the kind of person who would go for any sort of romantic comedy. Um, she'd probably like a horror film. So we're going to go to see They Came With Tweezers. Now, I really desperately need to remember that so she can actually review it. And I feel badly because she's like leaving her child at home with these people. <laughs> but they're her family and they don't mind helping out. But Evelina, you need to eat. Oops, okay. Um, we're doing a still life, right? Um. Okay. Let's see. She can draw herself. Eh. Eh. She can draw herself. <laughs> okay. She's seeing a movie. He is fine. His bladder goes... This thing is great. It's premium content, and, like, you put the babies in there, and their motives don't lower that quickly. They have fun. Their bladder goes up quickly. Why is he fiendishly delighted from watching a sim suffer? Who's suffering? Okay, she's hungry, and she's sleepy. Maybe he's happy because she's sleepy? I don't know. Um, let's have her really quickly... Listen to a guitar tab cast, and we're gonna have her study on her phone. Maintaining your influence with the rebels is tough when you aren't organizing protests or hanging out with them. Hannah Spiegel's title within the rebel social group is unaffiliated. She's fine with that. She's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, that's working. That's working really, really well. Okay. So yeah, she'll do that, she'll get some sleep, she'll go to class tomorrow, everything will be A-OK. -okay. Hannah's working on her sketch. She's actually talented at art, so there's something. Hang on a second. Herb nausea. Uh-oh, too many herbs made Hannah nauseous. Oh, excuse me. The thought of herbs makes her sick, so they should be avoided for now. Yeah, well, okay. She got, grasped the basics of street art. And she wants to tag something at some point, probably. We should do that. She wants to improve her painting skill, also. Why don't you go upstairs and just paint? Take a break. Get rid of this painting that Evelina made, because it's pretty atrocious. And she's only got one class tomorrow, so I'm not too worried. And we'll have to see if we can call a babysitter. That's the biggest question. So yeah, once it stops swinging, things start going down, albeit very slowly. By the time uh, Heli is done, she'll have come back here. Yeah, I know, you feel sick. Why don't you paint, um, paint a large. Oh, she's got a, she's got a yak. Evelina is going to clean the shower. Helia is just about out of the movie, so we're going to have her come back here and, uh, take care of Helix, get him in his crib, and whatnot. And then, Evelina, after you do that, you should sleep. Oh yeah, and her skill's gonna go up pretty quickly. Her academics are going up because she's listening to that tabcast. Helia Spiegel just saw a movie. Okay, yes, she will always remember on back and we'll have her write a review for that. Got a blog about recent movie reviews. So yeah, that's you'll get this little moodlet. And you'll get bonus followers if you do that. 
she's got fiendishly delighted from watching a sim suffer because of course when you see a film like that <laughs> that's what happens all right she doesn't need to get the mail um he's swinging he's fine uh, okay so let's have her blog really quickly and then we'll probably call it quits for this particular episode <clears throat> Alright. They Came With Tweezers was a plucky thriller which left me raw. Let's see how that does. It was amazing. She gained 51 followers. Okay. I'm sure you don't have to throw in the stupid puns, but it amuses me. So <laughs> that's why I do it. Alright, I'm going to set her up to eat. And then somebody's going to have to cook tomorrow. So yeah, that's... I think we'll, we'll end it for this time. Um, I'm sorry, I'm still like kind of kind of getting back into the groove. It's really um ignore that call. It's really weird because I'll try to record in advance and then I won't record for for a number of days and then I just get a little meh. So I, I should really stop doing that. It just makes it easier because sometimes I'm too sick to record. So I will find a middle ground. And uh yeah, so Thanks for watching. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, I love hearing from you. I know, like, I say this stuff all the time, and then I say I say this stuff all the time, but I, I acknowledge that it's sort of a repetitive thing. But I also acknowledge that I have some really great subscribers, some really great fans. I'm very, very lucky, and I'm so grateful to to have you all sort of go on this journey with me. So thank you very much. Take care, and I will see you next time.